Ha-ha-ha! Yoo-hoo! It still looks better at 1080, but you know, we'll take what we can get. And be thankful for what we have anyway. Let's go get some grinding done. A storm coming. Storms are coming. So anytime there's talk of storms on the horizon and such, I always think of in the movie Pet Cemetery, Fred Gwynn, who also played Herman Munster on the Munsters. Those of you who actually know what the fuck I'm talking about, um, he's on his porch and he just tells his neighbor, Storms are coming. And I always think of that. Hear about storms, or I go outside to smoke, or I'm just outside and there's like a storm on the wind kind of situation. That sort of thing. Is that weird? Does anybody actually know what I'm talking about? I'm assuming. by ourselves because ain't nobody else playing this game. Oh, we gotta go straight for the knee. Gain is not a lot though. Like, okay. 
better, which would be helpful. Then again, I'm not like min maxing, figuring out what all I should be doing. Okay, so that gets me a lot of energy. That cost. Okay. I think I see. Victory box. Mesmer Orb and collect marbles. After you don't know, kill a bunch of bastards on the way, of course. I really need a new MMORPG though. Like this is okay, but um, even for a uh, game with a cash shop, the cash shop sucks. Like I would hope for more cosmetic items, because that's what I buy in a cash shop. I don't buy boosts and things. I would buy an outfit. Black Desert Online, I bought outfits. That's what I did, you know? So, I should just go back to Black Desert Online. I mean, they did just do the full, like, HD re-release or whatever, and it's not necessarily a bad thing, right? It's not that I hate Echo of Soul. It's not that at all. It's okay. There's not a lot of people playing. There's no chance to do any dungeons or anything, which is why I, I really wouldn't want to play Black Desert. I mean, after you hit max level, there's not really much left to do in my book. I'm not into PvP, and I know that that's a lot of the end game. So. Ben, good morning. Oh, see what since you're here what I did. Hi, man! That's not what I... That was not how I originally had set this up at all, though. Oh, God, I'm, like, way too close to this camera. It's awful. Holy shit. Why am I so close to it? I guess originally I was just, like, casually uh, sitting back here. Then I was not. Well, good morning, Ben. How you doing today, buddy? Oh man, what the fuck? I know, you get to see my beautiful mug. Are you looking for me? Oh, it's craziness. This is in the way. Let's get that over. Like, I'm like all pro with my setup and shit. Well, except for the fact that you can see my kitchen. Sort of. Anyway, morning, T-Bear. T-Bear. Perfect fail. Yeah, I mean, that's pretty much how I, how I live my life, man. Don't make fun of my life choices. Either way, at least it was. That could have been a good jump scare, at least, you know? So I think what the problem is, I moved my chair. So it should have been like this, even if I'm up close. It's not as bad. Is your face cam not cause like? I mean, it doesn't appear to be, as near as I can tell. Um, you guys would have to be uh, the judges of that. So, yeah. You can see the man, the legend, the Waylands are I know, it's it's amazing, it's a beautiful mug. I wouldn't wear the hat, but you know, I've gotta hide my shame. <sighs> anyway, how you guys doing today? Sorry you guys are here for such a shitty game, but you know. I'm doing pretty okay, T Pair. I cannot complain at all. 
Life is pretty alright. I'm tired as ever, but otherwise... I mean, everybody can complain, right? There's always something that's not perfect, but... Overall, everything is pretty okay, so I'm not going to deny that right now. back. You're right, Ben, I did, but... Yeah, exactly, everything sucks, but I'm okay, right? Like, that's the thing. Everything is terrible, but, you know... It's not as terrible as it would be. <laughs> you shave yours. You know, I can't. I just can't. I don't like it. I hate it. I hate how society puts all this pressure on somebody, like, Oh, you're losing your hair! Well, you don't have to feel pretty or look good. Just shave your head because everybody else wants you to do that. It's like, what no, can that's I not what I want, child. And then if you get, you know, if you try to do anything about it, like, God forbid, a comb over, suddenly you're just a laughing stock and it's a joke and it's a pretty damn awful way to treat people. Because a woman, we would never do that. To. So. It's been ten years now since wow, the Imperium invaded the forecourt of India. Why was that so loud? Like Holy monsters. Shit. They killed by the thousands, showing no signs of remorse or mercy. We couldn't stop with that. Again, again and again, we tried to fight back, but there were simply too many of them. <laughs> so it kind of is you. Yeah. No, I can't do it. I refuse. I refuse to accept my fate. People lay strewn on the cobblestone. Not gonna no do it. Left to Never gonna do it. Proper burial. Uh, hope was running thin. Oh my goodness, do we care about this guy's voice? In our final hour, a hero appeared. A hero a appeared. Man by the name of Riggan stepped forth yeah. to God. Yeah, nah, we're cool. We don't care about any of that. That's a bunch of stupid lore. <laughs> Who cares about lore? I don't need lore. This is what more RPG. Help you with, child? Oh, I know I can do this dungeon on this. Hatsucha. It would if it fit better, I guess. I like hats, but I don't feel like they like me. But, you know, that's a big thing. You know, it, it, it is what it is. It is what it is. Ultimately, um, I don't know, it's just the masculinity and you Anyone? are very much associated with the amount of hair on your head, right? So, you need something, traveler. when you start to lose that, you feel like, oh, I'm not, I'm not as masculine, I'm, it's, it's not a good thing, and, and it's just a big old mess. It's okay. It's okay. We'll get through somehow because we have to. Is there any? I'm not missing any here. Um, Alright, so we are good to go through and destroy this dungeon. Or try to. I'm not even really sure what that does. <laughs> Yeah, you know, it's just that time of year, I'm just like, you know what, I wanna, I wanna look good for you guys. I just wanna show my beautiful face and feel pretty. So that's what I'm doing. Unlocked a new achievement. Yeah, a new achievement, Monster Hunter killed one of you monsters. That's a game I should get and play, is Monster Hunter. I would like to get Monster Hunter, but I can never catch it on sale. I'm a little bit on the fence right now, like you can get, um, um, you have my eternal thanks. shit, the Shadow of the Tomb Raider, the new Tomb Raider game is on sale for like 30 bucks everywhere, and I really kind of want to it, but I'm on the fence about it, and I'm not sure I can run it on PC, and I would much rather have it on PC, so, hair and wisdom won't stay in the same head, 
That's that's a wonderful saying, T Bear. I like that a lot. It's extremely true. You have my eternal thanks. Yeah, that's extremely true, and sad now that I think about it. You're basically just saying one day I'm going to be a bald, babbling old man that women don't want to have sex with. Now, I guess that, that's kind of the same as now. At least I'm not 90. So there is that. Nobody on the server. How can I have friends? Nobody plays this game. Absolutely. I agree 100% with that statement. <laughs> Thank God somebody is able to find us attractive. That's right, you said you started seeing, you found a lady bear, didn't you? You had mentioned that before, I believe. But you were kind of, you know, had met somebody, which is awesome. Especially at our age, God, I wouldn't want to be single at our age. Holy shit, no. Maybe that's enough being married. <laughs> I wouldn't want to be single to save my life. That that would be no. Oh, it's just a lot of I guess a lot of damaged people at our age, for lack of a better description. Um, Unlocked a new achievement. Like we've all just got certain things that have happened in our life. And stuff. I'm trying to get those to reconcile is. Insane. And no, that's not to say that everybody else is damaged. I'm 100% damaged. Oh, maybe damage isn't it. Baggage. Everybody comes with baggage. And at our age, there's a lot of baggage. <laughs> hey, we leveled up. Alright. Alright, alright. Very tiny years younger girl who seems to be fond of you. Official date is on Sunday. Nice, that's awesome. Well, I hope your date goes really well. I'm sure it will. I don't know why it wouldn't. It would have to go well. Ooh, Typhoon Charge sounds nice. Let's get that. That was not as impressive as I thought it was going to be. It was not an issue, actually. Staying alone. I mean, I do too, to a point. Like, don't get me, don't get me wrong. I mean, there's, there's times now where I'm like, hey, you know, it'd be kind of nice to be seen. Because then it's just like you, and you don't have to worry about anybody else, what other people want. You know, things of that nature. It's just whatever the hell you want to do live to the beat of your own drummer, but it, you know, eventually I did I would get lonely, I'm sure. So it's gonna give me boots. So I'm gonna give me a complete. Funny you heard someone say, oh god. Yep, of course, always, you know that. That used to be mandatory, remember? You used to have mandatory jokes. When you entered the stream, you gotta tell me a joke. The thing we did there for a while. I don't know why we stopped necessarily. I think we ran out of jokes and then we just kind of forgot. 
I didn't bring it up anymore. Well, we should probably defeat the dungeon boss first, huh? We should probably move away just in case for some reason. Oh, that's a long distance in there. I did not make that. Drunk Lord from Zen. He said Zen puts his sword on gasoline. Says his gasoline on fire. <laughs> okay, that's right. They are doing that, aren't they? It's like the one guy, Drunk Duck, right? He's doing the uh, Paladin's lore. Drunk Lord. Yeah, I remember seeing those. I haven't watched any of them, but I remember seeing the videos. Huh? There's no difference in those. Hey, and we leveled up again. Difference. Got ourselves a bag. watched any of them and I should but I just I haven't so I don't know it's a thing <laughs> I really should though at some point I just haven't I don't know why I don't really know why oh yeah we want that Almost old enough to drink. Do you have to worry about the drunk streams? See, this is this potion could have given me an advantage. I just never used it. So I'm an idiot. So let's see, song bags and oh, just some no vendor. Probably the best thing to do. There's all of that. All right. And we are done. Next is this dungeon. enough to drink what I, I mean yeah but the drinking age it, over there is like 18 or something here it's 21 and I feel like they're gonna raise the smoking age to 21 soon um, which is just dumb but I guess it doesn't really matter since I don't have to worry about that yeah you're in one of those lucky countries where it's not as much of a stigma or a taboo to drink. Here, I feel like we all grew up with alcoholic fathers who beat us, so now we're just like, oh, drinking is bad. You know, you're a little drunk in the middle of the day. You're an alcoholic. No. You know, that sort of thing. So. Fists speak louder than words. That's what she said. Okay, that is a okay. That's a fly. Birthday of seven days. Nice, Ben. Well, I apologize in advance because I am not going to remember that. So I will say happy birthday now. A little bit early, but still happy birthday, man. That's awesome. It's gonna be eighteen. What other special anything special goes along with that for you guys? Like, I mean, I guess here in the U.S., you're you're an adult. 
you're considered an adult legally at that point, and it's kind of that emancipation point of, yes, I'm no longer under my parents' thumb sort of thing, you know. But I know, of course, other other places do things quite differently and have different, differing attitudes on that. Like here, it's sad if you live at home beyond the age of 18. It's like, what? Like, if you don't have your own place to live, you be in an apartment or a house. It's just frowned upon. You looked at kind of like a failure. And I know in other countries, it's not like that. There's very much a, um, a, a family home type setting where everybody, like, you stay at home and you live and you help support the family overall. Stuff like that. Perhaps that's the dynamic for you guys as well. I hope so. It's a much more friendly dynamic. And things are starting to change here with that. Mostly because people that are younger can't afford to get out on their own because you know, the economy's shit. Pay is flatlined and all of that stuff. But for instance, Parker, I've already told him, look, if you, as long as you're working and helping out, you can stay living with us as long as you need to. I'm um, encouraging him to chase Careful, his dreams of Can't you supporting see the himself you're in? music and other arts, which would be fantastic if you could do that. So, you know, maybe I'm a little unique. Oh, I gotta blow my nose on it. Thirty-four dropped frames. At zero point zero percent. Stream seems to be holding on good. That's what. Yeah, and I turned away. Now imagine how that works out. I work in a call center. So imagine you're on the telephone talking to somebody, and you hear they hear that in the background. It's caused disruptions in phone calls on occasions. My supervisor was on the phone, and I blew my nose. And person on the other end was like, what was that? <laughs> and then she gave me a dirty look. All weird from there. And I'm like, what do you want from me? I come from a long line of geese, okay? That is our war cry. Or our mating song. It could be both. Have a win in Realm Royale. Nice. I need to play some more Apex Legends. I, I like Apex Legends, but I'm not good at it. And that's the problem. But maybe the face cam will help. Maybe this beautiful mug will start drawing people in, and we can experience some here to for unforeseen growth in the channel. That would be nice. Get a few new faces around. See a little more anime booty pop up. That would be that would be really nice. But yeah, congratulations and a win on that. Then I I not got a Carefully, win on that. Fool. Can't you see? I played for a little while. In? I didn't play for long. Never stop asking. I definitely played for a little while after long. What's your story, stranger? Is your trash at teamwork in Battle Royale? I mean, I am too, but I don't know, it's hard to explain. I, I just enjoy it more than other Realm Royale or Battle Royale games. And that's not to say that I love it. I definitely don't love it. I just don't like Battle Royale games in general, but it's okay. It's not bad. It's, it's worth a shot. And the team aspect actually helps what out. Point um, I last longer and have more success because it's a team in, excuse me, team environment. If I was by myself, and, um, that's not you. a thing that I would ever be successful with. When you were there, we've got a couple of wins under our, under my belt. Kind of like a battle royale paladin. Oh, I know. Um, I mean, I've played Realm Royale. Or I played in the in the beta, in fact, 
uh, not even the beta, there was an alpha phase where it was just an extra mode in Paladins. I don't know if you were playing at that time, but... Yeah, I, but I think the teamwork on it is definitely being forced into that is probably a good thing. At least in my case it is. Um, the only real problem I have with it is the healing it sucks. So I always go with lifelink because I, I play support, it's what I do. But it's not really, the game's not really made to play this type of support that I'm used to playing and enjoy and I'm good at. So. That's one thing I think they can improve upon. Now, there is a new one that's out. Um, I'm thinking about giving it a try, but it's more like an MMORPG battle royale. So you've got, you know, different character classes and things. And um, I'm, I'm thinking about checking it out. But I haven't decided yet. <laughs> Please Still a little on the fence. But it's free to play. It never hurts to try, right? Uh, yeah, you're absolutely right. It's not Ceres. It's not any of our direct healing people that we do. You know, it's not any of that. It's not even close to that. Ceres would not work in Apex. You're right. Ceres would not. That sort of direct healing would not be good in that game. It would lead to prolonged matches. For sure. Um, I feel like they could improve the healing that is there, make it a little more viable, maybe um, give Lifelink a gun that, sh you know, like uh, shoots a heal at somebody so you can take a more active role in healing, but it's just not built around that idea. <sighs> hmm, excuse me. Me? Which is fine. You know, it, it has to do its own thing. Just because um, I have those criticisms doesn't mean I'm right, of course. In fact, I'm probably wrong. I'm sure they know way more about their own game than I do. But it would be nice to see more of a... Uh, direct healing sort of game like that for a battle royale would be cool. Drone and close allies would be a lot better, but there's probably reasons it's not. Um, yeah, the the drone isn't for mid-battle. Right? It's not, you're absolutely right, it's not like Ceres at all. It's not meant to keep you alive in the midst of battle. It's meant to heal you up after battle has happened. Right? <laughs> So it can heal during battle, but it's not doing enough to really negate the damage that you're going to take in. So it's possible to use it that way, it just doesn't work the way you necessarily want it to. So. Yeah, at most, and you know that that could be what can I do for helpful you? if you can heal a teammate, get them a little bit, keep them a little bit out of a tougher situation than maybe they would have had normally. Hence the teamwork. But yeah. The, I mean, battle royale style games are just not my, my type of game anyway. So it's not a big deal. I, I enjoy it, but I'm not to sleep over the fact that, oh no, I don't like every little aspect of this game. No. No, 300 hours on Paladin's nice. I figure I'll probably get back to Paladin's in the summer again. I don't know that I'll play it very much before that point in time. I just, I just burnt out on it. Some plain and simple. Simply just burnt out because I played every day, especially in the summer when you guys really started showing up. I was playing every day for six to eight hours a day. That's a lot of time to be playing a damn game. What's up, Lord Seven? Good morning. 
be right back. from giving me like it's not a bad thing you are absolutely correct it's not a bad thing it can prevent you from just stopping altogether <laughs> so no definitely not a bad thing at all in most cases talk to Crawford talk to Crawford I'm doing alright Lord Seventh how are you today Everything good down in your hood, sir. That's not a thing people say. I know it's not. <laughs> I'll try not to say that again. It was pretty awful. Yeah, pretty bad. Can I help you with something? these early overpowered levels, they're great. I don't know, maybe I should stream Black Desert. I haven't played Black Desert in a long time. I reached max level and burnt out on it because after that there's no PvE stuff, there's no dungeons. Just PvP, and that's not cool in my books. Or I could go back to Bless Online, it's a possibility. Let's play a dead game nobody cares about. That's what we do on this channel. Nothing but dead games nobody cares about. liking that attack a lot, that's fun. <laughs> Just a fucking flying jump kick halfway across the stage. during battle. Oh, come on. Piece of shit. Just let me run away from the fight. Damn it. Then again, every day's a long day. What's new, guys? Tell me something good. I want a bear hat. Where Sleep well. Bear hat? Nothing like some good shut eye before a long journey. Yeah, I did. It's not a very good group name. 
then, but it's very good to meet you. I, I wanted some recognition for the people who had been around for well, a very long time. Make yourself at home. And you are one of those people. Do not expect acknowledgement. Your results are not sound. Ding! are offline. That's amazing. I didn't realize that. Is that not usually a thing? I don't know. Oh, we get another ability. What? I could have had a vitality boost? Shit. Oh well. Um, you know what? I want to check something. Because I am curious. Lord Seventh has been subscribed to the channel for four months. Um, let's see. Nietzsche was subscribed for six months. Ago. It had to have been around the time you subscribed. Seven months ago. About seven months ago was about when everybody really showed up. Cosmos at eight months ago. about when everything kind of started taking off about nine months ago. Yeah, let's see in there. Yeah. Let's see on there. Doing all right, Lord Seventh. How are you today? Yeah, Cosmo was eight months ago. <coughs> Yeah, no, I mean, the oldest subscriber I have is eight years ago, and that was the guy I knew back in the day. Other than that would be my wife four years ago. And then the next star is three years. There's a couple at one year ago. But as far as when I really started streaming games more, that was nine months ago. Man. I don't see how long you've been here, man. So many people on this list that would show up from time to time just are no longer ever in the stream. This makes me sad. Nikolai, haven't seen Nikolai in a long time. Dark Wolf, Dark Wolf hasn't been around in a long time. Hell, he's a moderator. I think he's the first moderator I had. Twenty-eight 
Boy Melissa not around. seen Logan Ramen noddles either. Six months. Funny boy has been around six months. Doesn't show up too often on occasion. Sayori was around six months ago. Yeah, that makes me sad Manica was six months ago. Maxino, we haven't seen in a really long time either. Maxino's doing well. I don't like the video that was put up one week ago, so there's that. So. Anyway, sorry. Got on a weird tangent there. We got to thinking about it. I feel like we were uh, definitely a growing community back in the summertime of last year, and then now stagnated very much. But I'm also playing shit games. There's that. The times I stream aren't very good for most people. So, I'm sure there's a lot of reasons why. Just not growing, but oh well. That's life. Maybe I just need to play Doki Doki Literature Club again. You know, that's the thing, though. People just want to watch uh, fucking Battle Royale games. I don't want to play Battle Royale anything, games. Just ask. It's like still the biggest thing right now. Because 12 year olds, I guess. I don't know. And it's just not the games that I want to play. Fists speak louder than words. Sleep well? Nothing like some good shut eye before a long journey. Yeah! I don't know, what do you guys think? Are there any games that I haven't played that you guys were like, oh, you know, I'd like to see you play these games? You know, I started Assassin's Creed on it. That's going well. I'm still wow. playing it today. Uh, it's another one of those that there's enough content in that game that I feel like an hour and a half that I normally get is not long enough to really get anywhere, you know? hard to make progress in that game because there's so much to do. Same reason I haven't played Red Dead Redemption in a while. I need to go back to that. Just because I need to finish it. You know. Or better yet, any upcoming games. You guys are like, hey, this is my favorite idea. I don't really know of any outside of the major releases and that's going to be super competitive. And then again, I guess it's always super competitive. Super Meat Boy, they were shooting rockets at you. That's Super Meat Boy is a hard game anyway.
Well, yeah, I'm always open to suggestions. Um, did Resident Evil 2 at least a little bit. Didn't pull in people like I was hoping it would. Yeah, I mean, you always gotta keep up on that stuff. The uh, Epic Games Store has free stuff all the time. There's a couple of them that are new. And, uh, like, Modern Warfare is free on PlayStation Plus this month, as well as The Witness, which is another game I'm probably gonna play. Because I've heard really good things about it. I like puzzle games. It's hard to just know what to do. Yeah, I mean, once you get your basic skills down, it's just knowing what to do when, and then going by those patterns. I feel like that's most things, though. Um, once you recognize the patterns, it's much easier to get where you need to be. And there's always patterns that Sleep naturally well? emerge. Nothing like some good shut eye before a long journey. As much as we like to think nature is random, RBDM there's, and all that. patterns there too, and it's been proven. That the, the thing you about no annoying. two snowflakes being alike is, is wrong, actually. Welcome. Make yourself at home. You need anything, just ask. You should check your backpack before your journey. It was fair not cruel, so if you fail, that is on you. Yeah, I mean, that's kind of how I feel about, like, Dark Souls. In the same way. You know, there's a system of rules in that game, and if you pay attention and learn to follow those rules, you'll be effective. If you don't, then, yeah, you have nobody to blame but yourself for dying in that game most of the time um, when you're playing against NPCs anyway. When it's against people, yeah, no, that's not Item the case, destroyed. but still. Item destroyed. Maybe I should play more Dark Souls. I haven't played Dark Souls in a while. The only problem is I don't have the good quality remake of the original Dark Souls in Dark Souls 3. But not Dark Souls 2. And I suck at Dark Souls, so there's that too. something and I feel like again I need some new games cakes one of one of two people allowed to call yes. me without making me feel weird okay no I still feel weird but in a good way no that's no no definitely not that I mean, that's cakes don't be silly I was gonna be like, that's just cakes, but it's not just cakes, it's cakes. Which is awesome as shit. I 
making it worse, I know. Make it weirder, oh, make it weird. Make it weird. <laughs> Yeah, I know I do. I exacerbate the situation by using words like exacerbate. While completely correct, they sound absolutely dirty. Yeah. Because it sounds like masturbate. But it's not masturbate. Can't eat anymore. Without getting paid, but it's for school. Okay, what, like a bake sale or something. I mean, it's still good experience, if nothing else, good life experience. Right? My rank is changing to nine. Rank in what? Working. I'm working with with handicapped people to see how they work. Welcome. Like, why does that sound like some weird Nazi thing where you're dissecting people? Because that's what that sounds like. Are you a Nazi? You're not a Nazi, are you, Kate? You never, you never seemed like a Nazi to me. Weird Nazi occult scientist. I mean, we all have go need to have goals in life, but that that's not a good goal. Basically, it's work for handicapped people. Like how handicapped? Like physically, mentally. Unlocked a new achievement. <laughs> not handicapped, just show them what to do and how to do it. Well, I mean, I know you're not handicapped. I was never under the impression that you were. Both mental and physical. Gotcha. Ah, okay, so it's like, hey, um, handicapped people are helpful too. They are not just a total drain on society. And you go and they're like, cool, here's how you can help. Handicapped person. And then they're like, yay, and then everybody's happy. Warp point registered. That, that, I know, that's a weird way to explain that. If your results are not sound. But it always is. Gotcha. I mean, it's helping uh, people who are handicapped, especially, I guess, people who are mentally handicapped develop job skills so that they can support themselves. Because, um, let's face it, they're not going to be able to be you need? taken care of by the system or family forever. So that's good. Um, I had... Parker's mother had a... Uh, has a cousin who's mentally handicapped. He has Down syndrome. And it's kind of the same thing. He was doing that with a group locally where they would make... Um, I want to say wallets or something. But it was so that he could support himself. Like, it was paid. It wasn't voluntary or anything. So he was actually making money, able to support himself, which is, again, the goal, because you're not always going to have Jewel inlaid. family there to take care of you. So. Warp point extracted. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. There's still a lot of stigma to physical handicaps, and especially mental handicaps as well, um, that really shouldn't be there. But you know, I think as a society, it's just kind of a thing we're still we're still growing into. You know. Super Meat Boy is a lot easier with the controller. Yeah, I bet it would be. 
lot more precise control that you can get then. Definitely would be easier with a controller. Dog, go away. Just stop. Stop. Get out of my face. Jewel inlaid. Jewel laid. Jewel inlaid. You're mentally challenged. It's okay, I feel like in this day and age most people are mentally challenged in some way. Maybe Jewel that's different. inlaid. Besides, it's okay, I still love you. In a strictly platonic way, of course. Okay, this dog is driving me nuts. Shut up, dog. Sounds when you're stressed. I don't think that in particular makes you. I also think a lot of people do that. How many cryptic maps do I need, man? That, is that weird to make weird sounds when you're stressed? No, I don't think. It's easy for you to see that you're stressed about something. I mean, that's good though, right? Because if there's physical and audible cues to when you're stressed out, say if you're going into a panic attack, I mean, you know. Welcome. You can scream, make you scream pussy at the top of your lungs to show you're stressed. So you have Tourette's? These old bones. Not like that. Mm -hmm. What can I you do? You just for like you? screaming pussy. I mean, I like screaming pussy too, but maybe that's a little different. It must be awkward. I'm sure people get used to it. It's amazing what we can get used to with enough time. Can't believe it's only 8:30. Be in the middle of a conversation. So, <laughs> oh man. So I'm just—I just picture you at home during these streams when awkward shit comes up. Just going, boss, I, I can't, <laughs> can't give up. I have a duty to fulfill. But I also really hope that there's no. You, yeah, I do, if you know what I mean. Well, I mean, they usually scream by the time I'm done with them. Mm -hmm. Now we're getting off topic. Whatever the topic may have been in the first place. Not at home right now. Well, I mean, that's good. Probably, right? Want to use a cat? <laughs> hey, any port in a storm. Welcome. Make yourself at home. Oh, shit. Yeah, let the tiredness set in. Ugh. Eh, 
you know, nice mental issues you. come in all sorts of shapes and forms. I think that's really the lesson there. Just because you may have some sort of a mental illness or other issue, then you know, it doesn't really mean anything. I'm bad. That kind of work is exhausting, I'm sure. I mean, I wouldn't know. I've never done it. I'm not nice enough to like volunteer my time for that sort of shit or anything. But you know. I would like to say I'm a very charitable person. I, I, I'm your average Joe, you know. This week, two weeks, this weekend, next week. So is it like a school program that's going on? A volunteer sort of thing? Are you required in your country to do some form of community service when you've committed a terrible crime? Because I can assume that you probably committed a terrible crime. Because you don't like them doesn't mean that they're disabled. I mean, I oftentimes feel like I must be surrounded by retards, to put it in a very insensitive way. But that just because I feel that way doesn't mean it's true. You need something? Even though it might be. I can't wake up because I don't drink coffee in the mornings at all. I really should drink coffee in the mornings. You know what? I'm gonna. I need to see the gem smith so I can actually try to upgrade my gems. I don't think I have the materials I need right now, though. No, I don't. I'm 
bless you. You don't say that when someone yawns? Not to my knowledge. It's a flawless theory. We don't. I don't know. Maybe you guys do there. Europe's weird. Hello. Oh shit. <laughs> you can do whatever you like, Cakes. We will still accept you and love you for who you are. Yeah, I don't think you were here for it, but um, Cake, I was asking what games I should play that I haven't already. You know, what games do you think will help grow the channel, both current and upcoming games? I've been playing some Apex Legends. That's that's picked up a few, um, but I'm not very good at it. So that makes a difference, of course. If you want to live, just go home. If you want to live, go home, coward. I need to do more research. Man, there's not enough of a benefit there to warrant that. Item appraisal complete. <sighs> Collect documents. Documents. But yeah, I'm always looking for suggestions for new games, especially if it's not expensive games, because I just don't have a lot of money, of course. Um, but I try to give you guys what you want, as much as I can. Competitive stuff. I mean, I could just go back to Paladins. I really was just like, hey, maybe it's because I'm not playing competitive games. Paladins would be a good one. Realm Royale would be another okay one. Apex Legends. If you want to live, just go home. Energy has decreased. I feel like competitive Energy games are always a pretty decreased. good bet. Uh, Well. 
this its own attack? Yeah, it looks like it is. Okay, so I thought these two were the same. Okay, it's just an AoE attack, gotcha. But I do not like rolling. Just because I don't, don't like it doesn't mean I shouldn't play it. Just try to get people to tune in, man. I think we're, we're, I'm getting back around to that point where I'm feeling the need to try to grow the channel again. You know, really try to seek growth. That's why I've got the camera back on. It's, it's proven when you have a face cam, it actually does help grow the channel. Uh, people want to see who they're interacting with. It helps if you're attractive, which is why I'm wearing the hat. To try to help raise that attractiveness. If you're anxious to die, I won't Probably stop not it. working, but that's okay. Um, it's, the, it's the thought that counts, I like. Good luck with that. I know, right? Oh, that animation interrupt, though. What the shit? Well, and again, that's why I'm asking you guys, you know, what do you guys think I should do? I'm, I can't be the only streamer you ever watch, right? So, when you watch other streamers, what are you watching them? You know, that sort of thing. Um, just some thoughts, you know, ideas, suggestions are, are always good. Again, I'm back to the point of, do I need to go flashier? Do I need to get Streamlabs OBS again, where I can... You know, have all the bells and whistles that people seem to really want. I've just never been a fan of that stuff. It always just felt gaudy to me. Garish. Man, Beat Saber is going to be tough today when we finally get to that. Holy shit. And I shouldn't even be tired. I got plenty of sleep. Put my chatter in act with their chatter both. Yeah. I mean, I know that's why most of you guys hang around here, because there is that direct interaction. It's dangerous around here. As far as a fun chat, I guess that's, uh, that's between you guys. <laughs> oh, I need to go back to Paladins and Coffee. But then again, you know, it's also with the with the mixer. the Paladin's Mixer channel, it's, I feel like that's killing other streamers because we don't have anything to give you. And all you have to do there is watch it. And you're probably going to watch it anyway, it? right? So it's killing everybody else on other platforms and who are streaming the same things. And again, maybe that's just my thoughts on it. It's not like I was big and huge into it or anything, you know. I'm no super bounce. Oh shit. Yes. Yes, what is it?
damage hits so. Oh my god. away from this guy. <laughs> it always, every time I kill one of those big monsters like that, it always lags. It's weird. cool-looking trident. That's neat. It's a, it's a new weapon model. That's cool. Can deal with that. Okay, so that's kind of like execute. Gotcha. Only usable when it's like below 50% health. Okay, that's a pretty decent crit chance, though, which is good. Today? No, I'm just cold. <laughs> Plus, since I've got my camera turned on, I thought I might have better try to look pretty. <laughs> T-Bear said I look fancy and handsome, thank you. Exactly, you handsome mother ducker. <laughs> you 
Oh, need something. you better stop. I'm gonna blush. It's a lie. I don't blush. Pleased to meet you. Oh, you're good, meet you. Oh. <laughs> Listening in the stream while doing other things. Wow, that's got to be super boring. We're playing a not very exciting MMORPG. Chat's not super active. <laughs> that's got to be the most boring shit to listen to ever. <laughs> Ash Wednesday? Yeah, I guess it is Ash Wednesday, isn't it? I don't think about it. I'm not religious. We don't really observe that much. My family. Um, I mean, yeah, it's totally like a culture thing here. Nothing I ever think about. Ash Wednesday, yes, it is a, uh, a religious thing to do mostly with Catholicism and Christianity in general. Um, I don't remember because it's what Palm Sunday and then Ash Wednesday is a thing. It's not like I need to just hear the game sounds. Like, yeah, that's true, but still, not a lot of talking going on. I feel like. Uh, but yeah, Ash Wednesday is definitely uh, it's a thing. It's more of a religious deal. Again, mainly, mainly half. All I know is I see people walking around and they got shit for a priest running on the forehead and it's ashes. I'm not sure exactly what it represents, but I know it has something to do with Jesus. First day of Lent, that's right, Lent is where you mark, uh, commemorate Jesus' sacrifice by making a sacrifice of your own. Um, most commonly, people will uh, pay penance by giving up meat, for instance. Um, like, yeah, ooh, that's hard to do, but whatever. Um, so, yeah, I guess you didn't go to school. Is it Leah Chan? Did Leah Chan go to school today? I'm assuming Leah Chan did not go to school today. Anyway, uh, it comes from the ancient Jewish tradition of penance and fasting. The practice includes the wearing of ashes on the head. The ashes symbolize the dust from God, from which God made us. As the priest applies the ashes to a person's forehead, he speaks the words, Remember that you are dust, and to dust you shall return. You know, ashes to ashes, dust to dust. If you don't use it, your dick will rust. Not the same thing, but it's how I remember it anyway. He also symbolizes grief, in this case, grief that we have sinned and caused the vision of God. Uh, but yeah, it's, it's the first day of Lent, and during Lent, um, Catholics in particular give up something to, uh, to honor Jesus' sacrifice, stuff like that. So, um, again, most commonly it's meat, and that's why on, um, in America anyway, on Fridays, you oftentimes have... Um, so, you often have um, fish fries, where it's just like... Kind of like a, a, a festival, I guess, and uh, they just fry up a bunch of fish because Friday it's okay to eat fish for whatever reason. You need something? But again, mostly a Catholic thing. Although I do like fish sandwiches, so sometimes we'll go to those fish fries. So it's cold, and it's Chapel Day. It's cold. How cold can it be? You're in Florida. You know what? Let's find out. What city are you in in Florida? It can't be that cold. It's okay. I was uh, 57 degrees in Miami right now, with a high of 78. Um, let's 
so so right now it's 19 degrees with a high of 39 for us here you're not cold <laughs> you are not cold you don't even know what cold is Yeah, it's 55 degrees for you right now. That's not a bit more like zero beach because a bunch of losers live there. <laughs> I almost became a priest. I was reading that straight off of Wikipedia or some shit. I'm not going to lie. I'm mean, going to have a vague idea. I, I do try to keep up on religion. While I'm not a religious person, I feel like if you're going to be against something, you really should have some knowledge of that thing. So have a valid argument um, as to why you should be or against or for something. Education is very important in this place. It's cold. We used to live in Key West, Florida when I was much younger. Um, so I get it, you know, living in Key West, it, it was always very nice weather, but once it did drop, it, even a bit, I think we were in the 60s, and I was like, oh, I'm freezing. Uh, yeah, Ben would be in Celsius, so 55 there would be super hot. And 19 would be downright ridiculous. So. Oh, shit. Excuse me again. God damn. It's very good to meet you. To be fair, it's a much better system. <laughs> Especially when we're over here like, it's 19 degrees, but it feels like 10 to the wind chill. I mean, maybe you guys have the same sort of thing. Uh, but I, I just always find it personally kind of dumb. But what I'm really looking for is, do I need a jacket? Do I need to wear a coat today or not? That's really what I want you to tell me. <laughs> it's, it's cold. Wear a coat. That's all I need. It's like on uh, Family Guy when they would always do the weather on the news on there. And they go to, it was, it was like Joel Jackson. And we are like, what's the weather like? And he's like, it's cold. Like, that's all I need to know. Is this cold? Or is it hot? That's, that's it. That's all I need. Can't leave area in battle. Got a bunk bed to come on the couch on the bottom. Nice! Who are you gonna just gonna be a bunk mate? You're not gonna share a room with your brother, are you? That's weird, because I've been watching this anime about that sort of thing. And I'm just saying, watch out. Just watch out. Actually, the anime I've been watching isn't that bad. Melting point? You mean the freezing point? Sunny room is painted light pink. I, I, Leo. That's one of the things that I do enjoy about you so much. You're just like this huge weeaboo. <laughs> I mean, I get it. You're you're actually half Asian, but um, still, you you like. I don't know. You're, you're American as shit, but at the same time. You're just super girly, and I think that's one of the greatest things. Ever. Just that juxtaposition is amazing. You can melt water, you can melt anything if you try hard enough. Warp point registered. Oh shit, look, someone else playing. Can I wave at them? I can't wave at them. Where I want to emote at you. Me? Yes, you. Come to me. 
If you ever need anything. How can I help you? Well, I mean, I know that. I've had one of those beds before. I would like one of those beds now, in fact, as an adult, just to save space in my room. The golems are getting stronger by the day. The only bad thing is, you know, getting it on would be more difficult than a top bunk. I mean, we could do it, but I don't want to hit my head on the wall or not, on the ceiling or anything, right? Is that a kangma? Technically, that's supposedly a llama, but I don't believe it. It's my one hour playtime reward. Hooray! Tells me nothing. Oh! Oh my god. I'm so tired. Love pink. I made the white fur on Mabel pink once with beet juice. You should do it again. That poor dog. <laughs> Hey, there we go. Hey there. That's great. There you are. Hi. This is awkward. You're awkward. What? Oh. What? I, what was that? Hmm. Here you go. Okay. <laughs> what? I'm not sure what that is supposed to be boasting about. Like to snuggle it? <laughs> Wait, snuggle what? The, what are we talking about now? You lost me. I'm a little scared. Talk me down, man. Talk me down. Giant rock man. Insufficient. Oh, the llama. Yeah. Yeah, they're pretty cute. idea of trying to grow the channel a little bit. Um, I'm just not really sure what should I what should I play to help make that happen. What what are some suggestions you guys might have? And of course in general just what what is there that I'm not playing that you guys would even like to see me play. Well you know I do use it. <laughs> It is a two-hander after all. But it's not dual wielding, that would just be weird. So you can wiggle. This is not gonna be a piece of kill. kill. Captured by your webcam again? No, it shouldn't be. Better not be. Fine, last time I was using Again, I didn't have the camera turned on, so that could be it. The Apex is big thumbnails. I mean, you're not wrong there. Apex Legends is kind of taking over the scene. And I have played some Apex Legends. Um, I do need better clickbait thumbnails, you're correct. Uh, stream corn hub. You're gonna see those fresh niblets get shucked.
And no, no, the the microphone's not on the webcam. It's definitely this one. See, it's definitely this mic, not the webcam mic. I did turn on the uh, background filter though. Let's try to get rid of some of the hissing and popping that was going on in the background. It was way too sensitive. And that could be what you're hearing is that. Plus, I'm, you know, of course, if I'm right up on the thing, it works just fine. I hope. So I'm seeing it all max out. So. Uh, yeah. Anyway, find young niblets. Watch them get shucked. I haven't played that kill even though we fucking suck at it. It's okay. I like when a woman sucks. At video games. But no, I suck at it too. Um, it's not anything I'm actually good at. I've got a couple of wins, but those have absolutely nothing to do with me. Right, see, but it, it actually still works, Kegs, because um, I said when a woman sucks, not a girl. Big difference. Big, big difference. You have to use magic to carry. I might have an item or two you'd like, but you'll have to look for yourself. Although I should stop saying stuff like that. You should check your backpack before your journey. <laughs> you're a woman. No, you're not. <laughs> Well, you may, you may be a woman, but you're no lady. <laughs> oh, what time is it? 9.15, so we've just about hit that point. We are at an hour and 43 minutes, which is about 15 minutes longer than we normally would have gone. Because I got started a little bit early today. Um, I think I'm going to call it here because I'm really tired and I need to play Beat Saber. I have to play Beat Saber. <laughs> So I'm going to switch over to Beat Saber, of course. That will be over on Twitch exclusively. So make sure you jump over to Twitch if you want to actually watch that. I know it's not the most exciting stuff. And it's a lot of me just heavy breathing into a mic. But hey, that could be what you're into. So wait, wait, look a little smaller in the face area. I'm not sure, are you saying my, it's because I shaved my beard, I guess. Well, nice and manly and handsome, um, but anyway, um, yeah, I'm going to switch over to Beat Saber in about 10 minutes, so feel free to jump over there and listen to all the heavy breathing if you like. Anyway, of course, as always, it's ringing out, guys. And we'll see you over there, hopefully. If not, as always, until next time, be kind to yourselves, stay nerdy. See you there, guys.